Okay, and so for number three, we've got a square root uh, happening or a radical happening on both sides. And so again, it's important to remember we can do anything we want to an equation as long as we do it to both sides. And so like on the left side there, I would want to square, to square that to make the radical symbol go away. And I would want the same thing on the right side. So let's go ahead and do that to both of them. We're going to square both of those things. That's going to undo the radical symbol. And then we have a pretty basic equation to solve here. So uh, same process we always go through with equations. We're going to subtract 14. We'll have 3v is equal to 7v minus 28. We'll subtract 7v. Negative 4v is equal to negative 28. Divide our negative 4. And v is equal to 7. So, uh, pretty simple, I think. Um, as soon as we square these things and get rid of the radical symbols, it becomes just a regular old equation. I'll leave that there and be moving on to number four. Okay, and so with number four, I'm actually going to make a separate video because I can tell that this one's going to get a little bit uh, more complex.